Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about mindset and building habits. If you haven't already read the book Atomic Habits by James Clear, I highly, highly recommend that book. I've learned so much through that book and I want to kind of translate some of the information that I've taken away from that book and give that information to you. There are some things that I was already doing as far as habit building, but I definitely gained some insight into the psychology behind habit building and how to make and break habits. So I'm gonna translate that to you all. The first thing you should do is get your mindset focused on the habits that you're already doing throughout your daily life. It's super important because research has shown that 40 to 95% of our daily activities are automatic and habitual. So what does that mean? The majority of the things that we're doing every single day are things that we do automatically without even thinking about it. So people enjoy doing things that they perceive to be easy right? We don't like to do difficult things, but the, the easy things or the things that we perceive to be easy are things that we repeat and we do over and over again because they're easy. So the first time you do something new, it can be challenging, uncomfortable, and even difficult to complete. But over time, when you keep doing this thing, it becomes easier. But it's human nature not to do difficult things, which is why it's so difficult to build habits. We want to do things that are easy. People love to stay in their comfort zones, but at the end of the day, your comfort will hinder your growth and your progress. So in order to develop new habits, you must first identify the automatic habits that you're doing on a daily basis. James Clear talks about two different strategies to help you identify these habits. The first one is called your habit scorecard. And this is a great exercise for you to try if you're looking to change your mindset when it comes to habits. On a piece of paper, write down all of your habits that you have throughout a typical day. So here's a sample of what your list might look like. Wake up, turn off alarm, check your phone, go to the bathroom, take a shower, brush your teeth, floss your teeth for some of you, <laughs> and so on. After you've completed that list, go back and identify which habits are mostly positive, which habits are mostly negative, and which habits are just neutral. And this truly depends on you and your goals. If you're somebody who's trying to lose weight and one of your habits is to eat a bagel with peanut butter every single morning, that habit might be a negative habit. But if you're somebody that's looking to bulk up, that might be a positive habit. So it really just depends on you and your specific goal. So you're gonna put pluses and minuses next to these habits and an N for neutral. If you're unsure if a habit is positive or negative, you can check out my video on goal setting and I'll link that here. And those questions that I address in the video will help you kind of determine the type of person that you wanna be. Identifying your habit can be challenging and sometimes daunting. Before we get to the second exercise, if you're somebody that needs support in this area, please check out the link below to fill out my coaching interest form. I can help you identify habits and create a goal that you can work toward in order to replace negative habits. You can also consider becoming a Patreon and select the level that's right for you. All levels will allow you to gain access to exclusive videos. And the top two levels will give you discounts on private coaching sessions with me, as well as a bunch of other perks. I'm going to be adding some more videos that take you a little bit more in depth into habits and how to create new habits and replace old habits. The second exercise to help you identify your habits, these automatic habits that are happening this every day. This video or the rest of the video is actually only for my exclusive Patreon members. So if you're not yet a Patreon, please check out that link below and choose the level that's right for you. If you learned something from this video, please make sure that you give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. Don't forget to click the bell to turn on all notifications so you'll be notified every time I make a new video. Comment below, what are some habits that you have that you'd like to change or replace? Thank you so, so much for watching. Happy habit building.